before death. Uh, I'm going to read Nate now, because I think that's more interesting here. Mayhem is really good. Okay, Mayhem. And it's called Memphis Doom, which is Baghdad's Doom. The Burden of Nineveh, Baghdad. The Book of Vision of Mayhem, the El Kapshite. The Holiness of the Lord, Judgment upon Nineveh. God is jealous, and the Lord avengeth, the Lord avengeth, and is furious, and the Lord will take vengeance on his adversaries, and he reserveth the wrath for his enemies, the ones to, to the Iraqis for destroying his land. The Lord is full of anger and great in power, and will not at all acquit the wicked. The Lord hath his way in his world. Tongue bomb blast. And in the storm and in the clouds are the dust of his feet. He rebuketh the sea, and maketh a dry in a dry land, and drieth up all the rivers. Bash and languisheth, and Carmel, and the flow of Lebanon languisheth. This is after Iraq passes the Bethlehem. The mountains quake before him, and the hills melt, and the earth is burned up to his presence, yea, the world, and all that dwell in it. Who can stand before his indignation? And who can abide in the fierceness of his anger? His fury is poured out like fire, and the rocks are thrown down by him. The Lord is good at stronghold in the day of trouble, the day of tribulation. And he knoweth that, and he know, knoweth those who trust in him. Christians. One, two, well, the Christians who have faith in him, that is. But with an overflowing flood he will make an utter end of the place, and darkness shall pursue his enemies. Tribulation. God's punishment of his enemies. Enough. What do ye imagine against the Lord? He will make an utter end. Affliction shall not rise up the second time. For while they are entangled together like thorns, and while they are drunk like drunkards, they shall be devoured like stubble, fully dry. There is one come out of this. There is one that there is one uh, come out of thee that imagine evil against the Lord, a wicked counselor, be Gorbachev or Hussein, I don't know. Thus saith the Lord, though they be quiet, and likewise many, yet thus shall they be cut down. I think he's talking about the Russians. Because they're quiet right now. When he shall pass through. Though I have afflicted thee, I will afflict thee no more. For now I will break his yoke from off thee, and will burst thy bounds in sunder. That has to happen, and that won't happen until at the end of rapture, at the end of tribulation, I feel. And the Lord hath given a commandment concerning thee, that no more of thy name be sown out of the house of the gods, and I will cut off the carved images and the melted image. I will make with grave, or thou art vile. Okay. The joyful news. Behold, upon the mountains the feet. Behold, upon the mountains the feet of, men, of him that bringeth good the tidings and publish peace. O Judah, keep thy solemn feast, perform thy vows, for the wicked shall no more pass through thee. He is as a cut off. Okay, the destruction of Nineveh, be kept. The destruction of Nineveh, be kept. That's the destruction of Baghdad. He that dasheth in pieces is come up before thy face. Keep the fortress, watch the way, make thy loins strong, fortify thy power mightily. For the Lord hath turned away the excellency of Jacob as the excellency of Israel. For the emptiers have emptied them out and married their vine branches. The shield of his mighty men is made red. The desert shield is made red. The valley of the men are in scarlet. Dead Americans. 
in Saudi Arabia. The chariot shall be with flaming torches in shall be the, the chariots shall be with flaming torches in the day of this of his preparation. Tanks will be on fire, missiles, ships, everything will be burning when the Iraqis nuke them. And the fir tree shall be terribly shaken. So they'll shake up the the blast of the nuclear uh, hydrogen bomb. The chariots shall rage in the streets. Cars will panic. People in the cars will drive crazily to escape the atomic bombs. They shall jostle one another against another in the broadways. They shall seem like torches. They will catch on fire. They shall run like the lightnings. He shall recount his nobles. They shall stumble in their walk. They shall make haste to the wall, and the defense shall be prepared. The gates of the river shall be opened, and the palace shall be dissolved from the blast. And it is decreed, she shall be led away captive into hell. She shall be brought up, and her maid shall lead her as the voice of the doves beating upon their breasts. But Nineveh, Baghdad, is of old like a pool of water, yet they shall flee away. Stand, stand, shall they cry, but none shall look back. Take the spoil of silver, take the, the spoil of gold, for there is no end of the store and glory out of all the pleasant furniture. She is empty and void and waste, and the heart melteth. And the meat that these smite together, and much pain is in the loins, and the faces of them shall gather blackness. Radiation sickness. Where is the dwelling of the lions and the and the, feed, and the feeding place of the young lions? Where are where the lions, even the old the lion walketh, and the lions whelps, and none made them afraid. The lion did tear in pieces enough for his whelps, and strangled for the lioness, and filled the holes of the prey, and his end with torn flesh. Behold, I'm against thee, saith the Lord of hosts, and I will burn the chariots in the smoke, the cars in the smoke. And the sword shall devour thy young, thy young lions. Radiation will kill them all. And I'll cut off the prey from the earth, and the voice of the messengers shall no more be heard. Okay, cause of destruction. As men of the saw sowed, so must he reap. Woe to the bloody city, it is all full of lies and robbery. The prey parteth not. This is, I mean, this is in the rack here. The lies and all the stuff, and I can take away, but they did. The noise of a whip and the noise of the rattling of wheels and of the prancing of horses and the bounding chariots. The horsemen lifted up both the bright sword and the glittering spear. Missile. And there is a multitude of slain, a great number of carcasses, and there is no end of their carcasses. They stumble upon the carcasses because of the multitude of the harlotries of well favored. Of the well favored and harlot, the mistress of witchcrafts, that selleth nations through her harlot trees, and families through her witchcrafts. Behold, I'm against thee, saith the Lord of hosts, and I will uncover thy skirts from thy face, and I will show the nations thy nakedness and the kingdoms thy shame. And I'll cast abomination, abominable filth upon thee, and make thee vile, and will set thee as a gazing spot. And it shall come to pass that all they that look upon thee shall flee from thee, and say, Nineveh, Baghdad, is laid waste. Who will bemoan her? Where shall I seek comforters for thee? Art thou better than populous Noam, Noman, that was situated among the rivers, that had the waters round about it, whose rampart was the sea, and her wall, and, and her was from the sea? Ethiopia and Egypt were set for her strength, and it was a limited. Put the Lubum, uh, Lubum, which is Libya, were thy helpers. Yet was she carried away. She went into captivity. Her young children also were dashed in pieces at the top of the streets. And they cast lots for her honorable men, and all her great men were bound in chains. Thou also shalt be drunk, thou shalt be hidden, thou also shalt be seek see strength because of the enemy. All thy strongholds shall be like the fig tree and the right and the first right figs. If they be shaken, they shall even fall into the mouth of the ear. Behold, 
Black people in the midst of thee are women. The gates of thy land shall be set wide open unto thine enemies, for fire shall devour thy bars. Draw the waters from the sea, fortify the strongholds, go into clay, and tread the mortar, make strong the brickland. There shall be fire devour there shall the fire devour thee, the sword shall cut thee off, it shall make it shall eat thee up like the canker word. Make this isle, make this off many like the canker worm, the radiation, the atomic bomb will keep them up, not the sword. Make thyself like the king, the locust. Thou hast multiplied thy merchants above the stars of heaven, the canker worms spoil it and bathe with them, they fly away. The princes are like the locust, and thy captains like the great grasshoppers, which camp in the hedges in the cold day. But when the sun arises, they flee away. And their place is not known, is not known where they are. A shepherd slumber, O king of Syria, thy snuggles shall dwell in the dust. Thy people are scattered upon the mountains, and no man gathereth them. There is no healing of thy bruise. Thy wings grievous, all that fear that be part of shall clap their hands over thee. For upon whom hath not thy wickedness passed continually. So they hear of Baghdad and uh, destruction. And some of the same destroy people clap their hands. 